Hi, hi. It's hot outside, and wouldn't you really like a cold drink? Exactly, me too. Today, I am reviewing a hard seltzer, the Truly Lemonade. So this isn't just a hard seltzer. This is a lemonade and a hard seltzer mixed together. It just says hard seltzer and lemonade. Last week I reviewed the PBR Hard Peach Tea and that was a strong contender for the drink of the summertime because it was super tasty, not super sweet, fairly inexpensive, but it did lack in alcohol by volume percentage. It was 4%, which is less than a PBR beer. On the spectrum from chill out to turn up, the PBR Hard Tea was definitely a, a moment for chilling out. And that's what you so this is 5% alcohol by volume. I'm gonna open it up instead of... It's 5% alcohol by volume, which is which is the standard for a seltzer. So at the top here is the mango flavor, mango lemonade. This also comes with four different flavors, which are mango, original, lemonade, strawberry lemonade, which I'm trying to match today, and black cherry, which is my least favorite flavor, my least favorite flavor which is my least favorite flavor of anything usually because it tastes like cough syrup to me. The ingredients are filtered carbonated water, alcohol, natural flavors, citric acid, lemon juice concentrate, sodium citrate, cane sugar, and stevia sweetener. It says 1% juice on the bottle. This pack of 12, 12 ounce cans. This pack of 12 12 ounce cans cost me about $22 which would be which would be 183 a can so i just told you how much it cost and all the stats about it i believe so i don't have my hand right now so i'm going to pour it out oh exquisite because it said it contained juice i wanted to see if it was clear it looks kind of like um lemon juice but i guess i'm going to slurp this bitch I don't know why I said that. I'm gonna go ahead and take a drink. <laughs> Hello? Hello? That was sour. This is sour. Very interesting. It's definitely still effervescent and fizzy. This tastes like an alcoholic beverage. This does not taste like a seltzer at all. Oh, at all. Oh, at all. I think of like seltzer, like I think of like LaCroix, where it's um, a whisper of a flavor. An essence. This tastes like more like lemonade than seltzer. And it's a strong lemonade flavor. And ma um, mango's there. I'm, I'm gonna have to compare this to the original because it tastes mostly like lemon. It's very tart. Mango seems more like an afterthought, so I'm wondering what the other ones are going to taste like. My different way of doing things today is that I'm going to drink all four of them so that I can accurately describe the effects of alcohol on the human brain. Because I realized in my last video that I drank one and a half seltzers, and I did report that I was buzzed. Maybe I am buzzed. I, I just get drunk so easily. So yeah, I'm going to complete all four cans before I go on to the next. And by the end of this, I will have drank four of these. I will rate the flavors. I will rate them as I do them. This this is growing on me. I was expecting a seltzer with like a lemonade flavor, but what I got was a... This almost tastes like a, a Rita, which is a very sugary drink. This contains one gram of sugar. How do they do that? It's the lemons. As a mango drink, if you were to give this to me and not tell me about the man Miss, Miss Mango, um, I would not know that it was mango. So, is the drink itself delicious? Kinda. Um, but it's not a mango drink, so I'm gonna give this one a 3 out of 5 so that I have room to go up for the other flavors. Except for black cherry. We're all in the same caliber. Except for Serena. But now I seem really biased. You know, I am biased. Does it look like I enjoyed this? Um, that's one down. Next. 
Here we go. How you are, you just have to say that you're fine when you're not really fine. Will it be purple? No. Yes? Kind of lilac. Hello? You didn't. Hello? Excuse me? Excuse me, bitch! This was- this is a different freaking drink. This is a completely different beverage. What was that? It's black cherry. This is a good one for black cherry. This was way better than I expected. But weirdly, this does not taste like the other one. This one is mostly black cherry. And the lemon almost seems like... Well, I would kind of say that the lemon and the cherry are... are teaming up and collaborating on this one. I'm gonna give the black cherry flavor a 4 out of 5. Trunk level, into, in, entering into certain territories. Two drinks down. Next flavor. Third verse, same as the first and second. It's kind of a baby pink. Oh, this smells like Flintstones vitamins. Am I gonna? This was the flavor I was most excited about. This was the flavor I was most excited about, and I'm feeling very much slighted and. I'm feeling kind of victimized by the smell of it. This is like the first one. I don't know what happened with that black cherry. That was so enticing and so scrumdiddly umptious um, and different and interesting and unique to me. I love that drink. But this is, this one tastes once again like the first one where it is a, it is a primarily a lemonade with strawberry the strawberry did not contribute to the project as much as she could have. As much as I was expecting her to when I dressed up as a strawberry lemonade today. Strawberry as a flavor. Have you guys had a strawberry? I can tell now that the mango was there in the mango one and the strawberry is less there in this one. Um, watch me taste the regular one and be like, oh, <laughs> different. They're good as fuck, all of them. Three out of five. <laughs> I can't do the mango one like that. I'll go 3.5. One more to go. I'm a three out of ten. The blueprint. The original. Fuck, it's upside down. Lemonade, hard seltzer. For posterity, I will pour it into a glass. <sighs> Milky white, no. Um, a juicy, a juicy sort of clear. So this one looks like straight up lemon juice. Smells like nothing. Miss sip, sip time. Okay, let's slurp it. I can't be blown away because I've gone through it twice before, but this is tart. This is extremely tart. But this is straight up Miss Lemonade. Now that I taste Truly's vision of what a, lemon, a lemonade and seltzer taste like, um, I can now confirm the strawberry and the mango are kind of the same thing, almost. Almost kind of the same thing. I'm gonna give this, the lemonade itself, the OG original flavor lemonade seltzer a 4 out of 5. Flavor, we got the mango was 3 out of 5, the strawberry is 3.5 out of 5, the black cherry, which was a dark horse, the black horse in this competition, I gave 4 out of 5, and the lemonade flavor, I gave 4 out of 5, and I would give the overall series a 4 out of 5. You are likely going to buy this in the party pack. They do have tall boys of... I think just the lemonade. That's the one. If you don't want to buy this 12 
drink party pack for $22 by the tall boy. These are pretty good. Are they the drink of the summer? If you have a pool, a pool day, <clears throat> Jesus Christ. This would fit in nicely to your summer hangouts. So if you want to add it to your porch hangs or your poolside shit, does anyone have a pool? Can I come to your hang out at your pool? Yeah, I'm gonna say I'm gonna say I'm kind of like in the approaching four out of ten. Mostly because I pounded three of these. For price, I'll give it a three out of five. It's not overpriced at all, um, but it's not it's not a bargain, you know. And uh, what's the last one? Strength. This is where it is. I'm gonna chug it. Cheers, mate. There's still some left. Strength. I'm I'm not gonna lie. I'm a five out of ten. Which is to say if I were to double this, if you bought this party pack and just went for it at your event or your party and you just were like, I'm gonna show up with this party pack and be completely set for the night. So for strong, I would rate this a four out of five because it's definitely stronger than the other one. Um, but there are stronger things yet to come. And I found myself quickly descending into drunkenness. So those are my ratings of everything, and that's it. I've drank four of these. I feel pretty fucking good. So thank you so much for watching. If you've tried this, I would love to know what you think of it. If you have any other beverages you'd like me to try, thank you so much for tuning in. Let me know if there's anything else I should try. I will literally see you next week with a different drink. And bye bye. And peace. Ciao. Bye. So she gave me my peach bellinis. And I was on my, my merry fucking way. And that bitch, Jen, you know what I'm gonna do, Jen? I'm calling your district manager. <laughs>